Hi, welcome to another episode of Art at Home. I'm Christine Spehar, and today we're going to be showing you how to make yarn out of plastic bags. Okay, so let's get started making yarn out of plastic bags. Um, and once again, we want to emphasize how important it is to reuse our plastic because if we don't, it most, more likely than not, we'll end up in the landfills or in the oceans. So today, we're going to be making plarn, which you can use to weave together any type of textile art piece that you would normally use yarn with. You can, you can make with plarn, which means plastic bag yarn. Um, and when we do that, we can have all of these beautiful art pieces, very similar to the ones we have here. We have this great wall hanging, um, these beautiful flowers, a dress. So these are just some examples of the things we can do with Plarn. And these were all made by our friend, um, Jamie Aware of Art Girlsy. So I just wanna give her a little shout out for letting us borrow her very cool art pieces. Um, so I'm gonna show you now how to make Plarn out of plastic bags. And I'm gonna bring in my little helper, Allegra. <laughs> Um, and so she's going to demo the process. It's a very easy process um, and this time you can use any type of plastic bag. So we have a thin plastic bag here. That's sort of, um, the, that's the kind that you get at the dry cleaner. We also have a grocery bag that's very thin and flimsy and then we have the thicker types of plastic bags as well. And these will all work for Plarn. So the tools that you're going to need and the materials are simply plastic bags and a pair of scissors. And the very first thing that you're going to do once you have your materials is flatten out your plastic bag so it's nice and smooth. And then you're going to cut off the handles. These are already cut off, but it's very simple. You just cut off the ends of the bag so that you have a square. And then next, we're going to fold the bag lengthwise one time, and then fold it again. And once you have that, you're going to cut about one inch segments from the bag. And you'll do that all the way down the bag and you can keep doing that with several bags, as many bags as you have. You can use them all up with this method, which is really great because I know a lot of us have a lot of plastic bags right now, especially with the pandemic and with COVID. Um, we are unfortunately using a lot more plastic. So this is one way we can use it up and do a lot of fun creative crafts with it. So once you've cut up the bag, you are now gonna have several loops. And it is her first time, so that's just to show you that anyone can do this. It's very simple. And if you get frustrated, just keep trying because it actually is a very easy process. So you're going to take one loop in both your hands and then you're going to place another loop inside of it. Yep. And so then you're going to have a, what looks like a capital letter T. And then you're going to take your hand and grab the other side of the loop and then pull it through itself while pulling on the loop that was hanging down, yep, tightly. And there you go, you have one segment done. And so you're just gonna keep repeating this process and creating a long chain of plastic bag loops that you can use to have your, to, with your plarn. Yep, so there you go. So what you're gonna do, she's just gonna keep doing this, repeating the process over and over, and then once you have that, you can roll the plarn up into a ball and just imagine like any yarn you would find at a craft store, it's there ready to be used. And you can use it to make all kinds of really fun things. So our friend Jamie Aware made this beautiful um, wall hanging. So she crocheted the um, plarn together to make this sort of sun motif. Um, another application for these strips of plastic is kind of using them to make more sculptural pieces. Um, Jamia also created this awesome dress here, so you can actually make clothes with it. There's all kinds of stuff that you can do with Plarn. So I guess that's about it. Um, I, we hope you guys get creative with Plarn and um, tune in for our next 
episode where we're going to show you how to weave with plastic. So it's going to be a similar process, um, but we're going to be using our own homemade loom. And Allegra is going to be showing us how to do that. So thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you next time.